Path to Purpose community, let's talk about it. Abundance or scarcity mindset? Ask yourself, which one are you? We're going to break them down today because as though people may hear these two mindsets, they may not fully understand what they mean. So let's run through them. All right. Let's start with abundance mindset. Abundance mindset is when you live off the paradigm that everything is plentiful. There's more than enough to go around. You see opportunity and strife. You see the glass half full instead of half empty. Yeah, that's right. We turn lemons into lemonade over here with the abundance mindset. You know, you get a pie, she gets a pie, he gets a pie, everybody gets a pie. I love it, abundance mindset. You know, that's the way we think about life. Then you have the contrast of that scarcity mindset where you always operate in a mode of lacking something. You never have enough. You never see yourself as being enough, smart enough, fast enough, uh, able enough to be able to achieve the things that you want in your life. So that's where you really just rest at. You know, you don't ever see yourself ever growing out or being able to change your reality or your, your surroundings or your environment because you just don't see yourself as having the potential to do so. And if that's what I want to speak about. You see that word mindset? It's because everything, whether abundant or scarcity, begins right there in your mind. You know, a lot of success stories, if you go in and do your homework, they come from people that, you know, they're, they're people that come from humble beginnings. They didn't have a silver spoon when they grew up, but that's not where they ended up in life. They're probably wealthy and successful today because they had the abundance mindset. Let's think about that. The difference between a person that's really like grown out of that humble beginning or still in that humble beginning, it starts in their mindset. Yeah. So if you had a scarcity mindset and you come from, you know, a humble beginning, you're going to probably be there because you don't see yourself ever getting out or amounting to anything better. Okay. You're telling yourself, I can't do it all the time. I don't really fit in. I'm not good at that sport. I'm not as fast as that person. So I can't, do, I don't work as well as this person. So I can't do that. I can't achieve that. I'm not as good as that person is at this or that. You see, you're always lacking something and that's how you view yourself. That's exactly how your performance in life is going to be. See, when you have an abundance mindset, you see strife as being an opportunity. So it doesn't matter what you don't have today. You believe so much in yourself and your abilities that you will achieve at some point. So you're going to move in that direction. And that mindset is going to keep you in that mode of winning. Yes. Yes. A lot of times these mindsets is not something that's innate. You are, it's impressioned upon you or you're formed through your environments. Okay, what you see around you sometimes forms this, you know, and it also speaks to what we talk about at Path to Purpose as far as fixed mindset to growth mindset. This also goes into that. This ties right in. Abundance mindset, definitely a growth mindset because you feel like you can achieve. You can, It doesn't matter where I begin at. That doesn't, that doesn't say where I'm going to end. All right. So you believe that. OK, when you're in a fixed mindset, when you haven't achieved and you don't have certain things and you. That's all you feel like it's going to be. So you just become okay with it and you, and you underachieve or you don't, you know, and that's just your life. You're just an underachiever forever. Why? Because that's what you told yourself. That's what you made yourself. So that's what we wanted to shed the light on today for everyone. Understand the difference between abundance mindset to a scarcity mindset. And ask yourself this question. Which one are you? Which one are you? That's the question of the day, y'all. All right? Like and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment to let me know how you're feeling. Share this video with others and allow them to ask them that question, yourself that question. Abundance mindset versus scarcity mindset. Which one am I? Hmm. I'll see you guys on the next one.